Imagine villa kites, a house that blends with nature and shows the future of modern design. In this video, I will show you step by step how to model this amazing villa in SketchUp. Before that, don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends. So let's jump in. Before we start, let me mention that all dimensions and measurements I use in this video are purely hypothetical and you can modify them as you wish. So first, let's create a base for the villa. Use rectangle tools, draw a rectangle by 3000, 850, like this. Then extrude it by 1100, like this. Then use move tool, choose this line and move it up to here. Lock the axis and move it up to midpoint, like this. And here too, lock the axis by arrow key, like this. Now Take an offset, use offset tool by 25 centimeter, then select the middle surface, use Ctrl C and take a copy, then empty here like this. Now select all and make it group. Then Draw a rectangle here, like this, and extrude it up to here, like this. Let me extrude a little bit more, like this. Then use busy toolbar, let me Active it with this option. Draw a curve here like this. Like this. Now we have a curve here. Yeah, here has a problem. Let me fix it. Like this. Now We need just here this shape, so let me empty here like this, then select all and make it group and use a scale tool and scale it up to here like this. Then use solid tools subtract of solid tools the first selection and the second one like this so now let's create a staircase here use rectangle tool and draw a rectangle here 75 comma 777 enter like this and extrude it by 10 centimeter select all and make it group then take a copy use move tool and take a copy let me use X-ray here, move it up to here, then type 4X like this. Now let me select all of them and move them a little bit here 
like this. Now it's good. So, and also let me scale this one. Use scale tool. Scale it up to here and make a surface here. Then let me select all of them and make them a single group like this. So now go to edit menu and click on paste in place. So now move the face here, lock the axis, move it here like this and also let me create another surface extruded by 30 centimeter select all and make it group move it up here then use a scale tool and scale it to up to here like this and also here too like this and here to x-ray up to here like this and also here too like this now let's create a handrail a glass handrail here first go to inside of this group then draw a line like this now select this one this one and this one use ctrl c and take a copy go out of this group then use paste in place then use offset tools and take an offset like this then select these lines and use jhs power bar with this option we can extrude these lines like this by 60 centimeter like this now we have handrail here and also let me select all and make it group now let's create a window here Now, as you can see, we have a window like this. And also we have a window here. Let's create that. Draw a rectangle here like this. Extrude it. Select all and make it group. Use move tool move it up here like this then here like this so now again use solid tools subtract the first selection and the second one like this now just use 
rectangle tool, draw a rectangle here, select this face, and 1001 bit tool plugin, and with this option, you can create a window. You can determine the number of rows, for example, four, column, two, and the other, and the other option, like depth, seven centimeter, weight, five centimeter, and just click and create window frame like this now we have window here so now i want to take a copy from this window in this side so how we can do it use flip tool as you can see we can't use flip tool here like this so what should we do first make explode the window again make it group like this now you can use flip tool and move it here just press ctrl to take a copy like this So now let's put a material, let's put a glass material here, paint bucket, press Alt key, then go to inside of this group, paste here and here too, like this. So now, as you can see, we have a window here and also let's create a window here and here too. Go to inside of this group, draw a rectangle, for example, 500 centimeter, comma, 150, like this, and use push-pull tool empty here like this then draw a rectangle here select the face again use 1001 bit tools plugin and the number of rows one and six for column and click on create like this and also let me put a glass material like this and also here too And also put a glass material for this handrail, like this. In this video, I don't want to work interior design, just I worked exterior design. I hope this tutorial was useful and helpful for you. For more tutorials, please subscribe our YouTube channel if you haven't already. And don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends.